Good afternoon, my friends. Quick video for you. I don't know if you guys noticed this, but we had a pretty rare seismic event take place in Alaska just a little while ago. You're looking at what is said to be a 2.7 magnitude ice quake. Yes, you heard that correct. This was an ice quake that took place in Alaska, which isn't unheard of. These things do happen, but according to some of the scientific methods and people we have out there, you can see it right there. The world's glaciers melting faster than ever, specifically Alaska's rate among the highest on the planet. Now, I'm not going to get into a history lesson on the melting of glacier ice in Canada or anywhere else for that matter. It's an overall idea I want you guys to be aware of. We're going to be seeing more than likely a lot more of these types of quakes. It's represented by a diamond just like a quarry explosion is that we see a lot of, believe it or not, along the western coast of the United States. They blow up a lot of things on the ground in one of the most unstable groups of land masses that we have on Earth. But that's neither here nor there. As you guys know, I've been doing a lot of stuff with Antarctica, and believe it or not, a lot of the reason we can see these things is because of melting ice. Not all of them, but it's a common theme. It's not just the North Pole, but the South Pole as well is registering a lot more melt than we're used to. And it's definitely a new type of science, I guess you could say, that I'm definitely diving into, getting used to, and I'll be able to explain a lot more to you. But I saw this pop up and had to share it with you guys, because you don't see these too often, but chances are we will. And more than likely, along this fault line right here as well, because of the broken ice we have already in this area some of it has land underneath it some of it doesn't but regardless this took place 2.6 kilometers deep so think about the amount of ice needed and the amount of force and power needed to generate an ice quake i'll do my best to stick to the interesting parts of these types of situations so we can actually enjoy some of it and get some interesting information out of it rather than all fear-based stuff so but there you have it my friends quick short video just wanted to throw this out to you 2.7 ice quake 52 kilometers east of juneo alaska take care my friends bye bye stop right there my friends if you have not already click that subscribe button and don't forget to hit the bell icon, click all, and you will get all notifications from this channel. And trust me, you won't be disappointed.